dark butterflies capable of turning anyone with even a hint of anger into a terrifying monster. Why is that a miraculous thing? You know, I was wondering the same thing. I don't like how he's staring into my soul. <gasps> of course they made the food bet look better than reality. I don't like his eyes. Yeah, she actually looks actually more Chinese. Oh, yeah. They made her face yeah, a little different. Yeah, she looks like actually mixed this time. Ah! Oh no. What do you mean, oh no, I wish my dad did that. I smell something burning. No, no, no. She definitely made that apron for him. That's so cute. Doesn't she live right across the street from the school? I don't think so. Doesn't she live across the street from a river? When I could be That's not Christina V. I didn't know it was a musical. Christina V releases music. I know. It doesn't fit. I don't like it. No, it doesn't. Isn't the singer like 19? How does a 19 year old have a deeper voice than Christina V? It needs to be a princess, not a queen. I like the song though. The song's good. <gasps> I literally waved at you. What? I know. People are gonna think you're weird because of this, not because of anything else. I like her drawings better than this one. They're yeah. more kitty. Yeah, that's the that's between her, the school, and her house. Then why do we have this whole like scene where she's walking <laughs> for so long? Because <laughs> it's a musical. It takes her five hours to walk down the street. That's why she's always late. <laughs> <laughs> There she is! There she is! There she is! Oh, that's actually uh, a cool car. That's a- Wait, it's a- It's sponsored! It's, it's, it's sponsored content! Oh, oh, God! He looks like a person now. I like it. He has a massive forehead. <gasps> I want copies of every review as soon as they come in. <laughs> he looks more, like, handsome, but in a weird way. It's, no, I really like this art style. He's Uncanny Valley. What's up, dude? Just- <laughs> <laughs> Wow! Close! That's a thumbnail. <laughs> they made her mole more pronounced. It looks more real. It looks more real, but also it looks very in your face now. I can't stop staring at it. It's bright. That's the thing. It's, it's, it's reflecting bright. light so much. It's the same texture as the hair, and that's not how moles are. It's skin texture. Aww. Aww. There's actually like stuff from the what they wanted to include. From what? The original. What the heck is with the school? It looks fancier. You have all the time in the world. I would give every moment I have left for just a glimpse of you in that dress, Emma. Why is he his more sympathetic villain now? <laughs> the lockers don't have locks. <laughs> They're just cabinets. <laughs> of course, the library, the last place someone like Chloe would look. There he is. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> I like this meet you. What's funny, what's sad is that the wired headphones date this movie now. It's not or, now. Or, or because he's rich and because he's an influencer, his dad's like, you know what's trendy? Y2K. You know what we're going to do? Put you in headphones and they're going to come back. Because that was a thing. That was a thing? Yeah. Like, girls would be wearing old school earbuds. We should pause it so I can make I know. Um, especially in my college, the rich girls especially wear big headphones with wires and they weren't plugged into anything. And then they would take them off and then put their AirPods on, AirPod Maxes or whatever. I mean, headphones are an awesome accessory, but it's if it's a thing that's supposed to be used and you're not actually but using it's fashion. it. That's, you can also just like have an actual, you can have actual like wireless headphones with an aux cord like plugged into it, not hooked up to anything, and then have wireless going and actually listen to music through them. Like that's an option. But fashion. <laughs> Kitty. Oh. Your world fashion interview tomorrow. First. Thing. He's below the Eiffel Tower now. That's new. I don't think they were wearing all black. No, they were. Are you sure? Yeah, I did. I used that as. A what the hell? Why does he have a long a? Why does he have a mullet? <laughs> the bomb. It's not Deposit. a the bomb. <laughs> The worst part is, I think it actually like works on him. I think they should have gone with a man bun, but that wouldn't, that wasn't a look. No, yeah. it wasn't. He just fingered his wife. What the hell? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm oh sorry. my god. I don't know why that was the first thing I thought of. I like how the miraculous actually Chaos looks like it could be I made. Mm -hmm. Like somebody on Etsy made it themselves. Do the Kwamis are representations of the entity of the miraculous so they're like actually gods 
and the Kwame is just how they present themselves. So they're like avatars. Yeah. She literally got hit by a car. Mm -hmm. When I got hit at that speed, I rolled on the hood though. Well, that car just has better brakes. Life saves the world. He needs to work on his pitch. Don't be afraid. When did the I wasn't that fast. Die. Die. You only think about yourself. Find her. Well, that was easy. You could have just stayed there. How is this possible? Look at you. <laughs> he tried so hard. <laughs> did everything he could. Yeah. Oh. Die. To his heart and unleash his rage. Whoa. Oh. We got a growl now. Why does he have a statue of himself? Who saves the life saves the world? Is that new or is that from the show? That's new. Okay. Pause. That really is easier. But this way it's closer to us and it'll be catching our voices easier. She just puts them on. I know, you're in someone else's home. <gasps> Candy cut! Oh, me though. Huh? <gasps> she has little toe beans! I'm gonna be honest, if I was in this situation, I wouldn't be freaking out as much as she is. It's a tiny, adorable little thing. It's like meeting a puppy. I'm not gonna freak out. And you can do Why wouldn't we have a musical? A, so is... a song. But that's her voice actress. Well, at least we have that. Tiki's only, what, immortal? She has a lot of time to come up with just songs to introduce. Becoming a hero. That is not me. That is not me. Oh my gosh, I don't know what I can do. Let me sing. I need a hero. It's literally Marinette's voice. Literally. <laughs> what? What I miss? This is the theme song. She sounds like a Lee Carvalho. That's Who's that? The voice of Moana. Oh. Oh. We don't even get the magical girl costume change. It's just your ladybug now. This isn't scary, Marinette! Why are you screaming? <laughs> There's gonna be hell to pay, I tell ya. He said hell. You know, they- uh, the, a guy said hell in season 5 also. Apparently they can say hell. Wow. That's the yo-yo? Yeah. Wow. Now you see, that's merch that they should be making. Not dolls, all, not just dolls. I want the yo-yo. It's like sentient. It's that like, makes sense as to why it's so good at its job, though. It's like Doctor Strange's cloak. Like but Tiki actually manifesting as the yo-yo and not just like a subconscious part of her. They broke the it's not the first time that Notre Dame has been destroyed. Too soon. Not no, too it's soon. been it's been it's been destroyed multiple, multiple times. I meant in real life. There was a fire. Yeah. A few of them. <laughs> I love his hair. Now you see, I like how he just immediately goes, you know, I'm a hero now? Absolutely. I'm on board. Giving away your every move. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. I love this Adrian. <laughs> I like how also he's the sidekick in everyone else's mind in this universe. Yes, and in our universe. In real life. No, they're partners. They're equals. That was the whole episode in season one. That's nice. I see him as a, as, the, as the secondary. Damn, help me! It's my first time! What? It's our first time, too. Go slow. It's his first time. <laughs> Is that a watermelon? Uh, she knows immediately. Are you okay? Just what the hell? Just what the hell? Haha, he got water. What great slapstick. I'm not joking, that was good. Yeah, I'm actually really enjoying this. Yeah, this is actually. This is much better than I thought it would be. Ass up and everything. Wait, Captain Moore's mask is sparkly. It is? <laughs> He's so baby girl. Oh, she's finally getting like the bug vision. I thought they established like it wasn't part of her powers. Like she's just really good at that. That's her confidence in herself. Why is the wheel square? Oh, ew, what? Is that a thing? That's the electric van my dad wants. Cause it's the old 70s style van. Ew. Oh, okay. I thought it would crash and like break the, I thought that would break the train. I thought we'd, I thought we'd move this from PG to PG-13 in a heartbeat. God, I love the details of the mask. Ah, oh, it's like Spider-Man. <laughs> That's the music that I was playing when you met me, right? I feel like I have a little bit more taste than that. <laughs> now, See, you can't see And how come you know all this stuff? He's very boy. 
I get to break stuff. Cool. I like this character better than the Adrian in the show where he's just like Mr. Perfect Pants. Yeah. I mean, I feel like it was always the case of this is just the first time he's able to break out of a shell. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But even in as Adrian, he's like, that was weird. Girl weird. She probably don't like me. <laughs> <laughs> Furry warriors cat kid. He looks baby girl mostly just because he looks like he has like pink lip gloss on all the time. See, this sounds like him. Like we can't tell if it's no, Bryce. No, we can't. He sounds like the Backstreet Boys. <laughs> I'm listening to the lyrics. Oh, I thought you were like, oh, it does sound like the Backstreet Boys. I mean, yeah, but... <laughs> Incredible. He down bad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't appreciate the fart jokes. I suddenly like the sh- movie a lot less now. Yeah, but... Yeah, but what? You gonna defend the farting? It makes the reason that Adrian doesn't like plague eating cheese a lot more reasonable. I never had much of a feeling other past like season like one or two. I never had the feeling he really disliked plague eating cheese. But yeah, he was so dramatic about it. Now I know why. Because he stunk it up in there. He's got a bell on his suit. There must be something you can do to- Yeah, wait, she has a point. If he's supposed to be sneaky, why does he have a bell? <laughs> because it's his true heart's desire and kitty cats always deserve bells. Except they don't make sure that if you get a cat, it's actually pretty dangerous to have a bell on their collar now. So I'm trying to find a way to make it so that it's not- it won't get caught on things because when they lick themselves, their little tongues get stuck in the little bell grooves, groups, and then they'll get caught like that. Then it hurts their tongue. And that's why I want to get like a little, not like a bell bell, but like a little, the ringy, the ringy bell. Maybe that won't get their tongue caught on it. As oh, much. like a cowbell sort of de- sort of design? Yeah. Or yeah. like a maraca, maybe? Maraca. Be careful of the cat bell that Cat Noir wears. Dangerous. It's evil. I like how they're wearing watches now. Why? Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm heading home. Paranormal attack. Oh, does it hurt him to use it? I just thought he was depressed. It's everything. I have nothing to lose. You have a son, you jerk. Wow, we went full Disney, making it green to show that he's the villain. Green and purple. Green and purple. That's the combo. Because it's the Joker colors. <laughs> That's actually probably not why. <laughs> probably not why, but you're right. Is this his imagination or is this like real? Or oh, is this like the catacombs, like the the like a really really dramatic version of the the dead catacombs of skulls underneath somewhere? We're gonna be listening to this in the car a lot, aren't we? Yeah, this is a good villain song. Damn that tenor, though. I sympathize for him so much. <laughs> now I want him to win. I think it was just the lighting that was in the school that made her mole glow. Oh, you have been a fabulous son. She's hot. Yeah, I thought the same thing. They don't call me Dr. Love for nothing. Well, number one, you gotta be somebody else. <laughs> don't be yourself. You suck. Don't forget to bring roses. That shows confidence. That means he's desperate. If he tries, he's desperate. If he bothers, he sucks. If he wanted to, you he wouldn't. Oh, I thought she dropped the macarons on the ground. I was about to say, like, I don't care if they're on the ground. Macarons are macarons. They're f- so good. I think she did, but they're in a box. Oh. A Wilhelm. Wilhelm scream! I want to go on a roller coaster. I want to go on a roller coaster. You want to go to Six Flags or something? Yes, please. Hey, Rich. you just littered. He's a mime in France, and he's doing vape he just tricks. He just littered in mime laws. Oh, no. They're going to die. Hey, that actually happened recently. They did? Yeah, people got stuck upside down on a, on a roller coaster, and some of them needed to go to the hospital because it was hours. You know, when I see someone committing acts of terrorism, I don't look at them and say villains. See, but when they're dressed up in fancy costumes and not okay, ski masks. You know what? Fair point. I think that's like the only defining feature of a villain. <laughs> you need a costume and presentation. I don't like this. Why not? It seems a little inappropriate. For what? Instead of having a transformation, like where she's like, it's a musical number, she's singing. I'm deciding not to suck for a second and I'm gonna do it in song. Why would this be bad? I don't know. It reminds me of Let It Go, I guess. And I don't... Why is that bad? Do you okay, not like it. Let It Go? No, because Let It Go does not progress the plot at all. It just evolves her character. And musicals should always evolve the plot and evolve the character when it's a musical number. Okay, you just said it evolved her character and 
musical numbers should evolve the character. And advance the plot. It didn't advance the plot. As she just ha- made a castle. Also, the song lyrics don't have anything to do with the movie. It was a cash grab song. Well, duh! I disagree. Mostly just with the, like, I feel like the characters are the plot. Yeah. So if you're progressing the character, you are progressing the plot. If you can do both, then that's better. But I don't feel like it's bad. It's definitely a cash grab song. But it's, I, I like the song. It's catchy. I mean, duh. Good music is just good music sometimes. Why do we have to think about it so hard? Because I grew up in music. You did. I can't hear nearly as much stuff as you do. I heard the theme and you didn't even get it. Like you probably saw Spider-Verse and like picked up on all the really cool little bits of musical things that were happening throughout that whole movie. And I'm like, I needed a TikTok to, for someone to explain it to me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And I like the sound effect of her landing on the dot. I'm being hypercritical of this now. When are you not? Because it's my favorite show. Mm-hmm. The biggest fans are the are the harshest critics. Love you. Love you, but I hate everything you do. But I love you. <laughs> Time to make you disappear. Is she hot, or is just the magician outfit hot? The outfit's hot. Yeah. Tea. What's tea? <laughs> You're pulling my leg, right? Haha. <laughs> <laughs> ha. But um. You know, I guess if this was real, if, if, like, people did start dressing up in costumes to do vigilante justice or villainy, it'd be really hard to differentiate them at the beginning. The only way you can tell he's good is because he's blonde. What? No, most villains aren't blonde. <laughs> Are you dealing with colorism? Yeah, I'm trying to- I'm trying to think of a villain that's pa- blonde. Pause. Because white is good and black is bad. No, I get that. White hat versus the black hat cowboy, you know, made that whatever. Westerns. I mean, that it predates Westerns, but whatever. Gotta be a blonde villain that I can think of. Does he show his hair, though? I can prove- Do they show their hair? I can prove- I can- I can prove you entirely wrong with one example. I just need one example. <laughs> <laughs> the Louvre. <laughs> good point. The Louvre. Uh, I Louvre you. Ladybug, and you are? I'm just the sidekick. I told you. We're partners. Told you. We're partners, you bitch. (laughs) We got car. Oh my God, the brand sponsorship is strong in this movie. I love Hondas. I, okay, but no no joke. If they actually have a Ladybug and Cat Noir car. That's so cute. I want us to have that those cars. They do too. Can Volkswagen sponsor us with cars, please? Do you want to fight? Mm. Well, like scratch. <laughs> Careful not to break a car. This is a metaphor for fucking. I think so. I I felt the same. <gasps> Force proximity. No. You're hurting me. <laughs> I'm excited. Fan fiction writers take notes. Our villain, he sent her away. He's probably oh, she's left handed. They're in love, and they're gonna get married. <gasps> and the kids. Oh, here's the boy. After my mom died, I promised myself that I wouldn't get close to anyone anymore. After my mom died, I chose not to heal from her death and be sad all the time. Oh. But why not? Yeah, you hurt somebody else's that isn't reciprocating your feelings. So why would you not? When there's someone who's clearly better, even though they're the same person, but they're clearly better. <laughs> I know it's gonna work out. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm your father. My father? I lost my dad a long time ago. He's so angsty. Oh my god. Yeah, we don't see this in the show. What happened? The dog's out. Oh my god. <laughs> All the other text is just lines. Now for all you new fans of Miraculous, get ready, because this is the entire show. This is the whole show. Them wanting to be together, and then they can't, because reasons. And when you think they solve a reason, there's a new reason. They're not allowed to be together. And then we suffer for it, and we love to suffer. Okay, I know that she's rejected, and I know like this is the that's the point of the song, but it kind of feels like they broke up, and she's like, okay, now I need to find myself. Like, it was too quick of a turnaround. I hate you, Lady Buck and Cat Noir. Was he, has he always been capable of doing this? Probably. 
Oh, well, green plus. Oh, shoot. They have medical marijuana. <laughs> you got to make sure the weed stays intact. The in weed tech. stays intact. You can't burn that all right. <laughs> She's literally like, the world is dying. Save us. How do you not feel it? Like, wouldn't everything be shaking to a certain degree? Especially since he lives under the Eiffel Tower. It looks <laughs> like you do need me after all. Your boyfriend too busy to lend a hand. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Ooh, it's slimy. Oh my god, save him. He'll fall in the water. He'll be fine. No. Everyone knows that falling in the water means you're automatically okay all the time. He, I think he's going to be fine. He's, he fell in the water. That means he's fine. He's just chilling. I don't know why she's so concerned. <laughs> Jeez. What the fuck? They made him so cool. When could he do that? He's got the force now? What? How did he do this? I don't know. Yeah, you were just punching and kicking and scratching your son. Does he always know it's Adrian? What? But no, I mean like in the show. No. Yeah, like what? They're changing things. Do things reset? What's going on? What happens in season five? Lots. Oh my God. Why did they release this now before season five finished dubbing, finished airing in, in English? This is completely different. This is like Monster High live action versus Monster High reboot. Oh, they made Gabriel good. Sympathetic villain. Yeah, I'm liking the show. Yeah, that's awkward. <laughs> She's so big. What? I guess we don't need to care about her secret identity either, maybe. She did Miraculous Ladybug. No, she, I, she's gonna. She has to. She's gonna miraculous ladybug. They kind of gloss over how many people die during these cataclysmic events. Peace has been restored. My dad's dead. There she is. So, <laughs> so did no one find out her identity? No. Only Gabriel found out Cat Noir's identity too. So is this movie just gonna be completely standalone? Yes. I thought this would be a proper like introduction to the to the show. The world is at peace, but my heart is still in turmoil. The world is not at peace. Paris is at peace. The world is not Paris. Ah! <laughs> it's just like the show for real. <gasps> it's a good movie. It's a good movie. It's weird. It's a, it's a great movie for someone who hasn't watched the show. Yeah, when, now that I've seen the show all the way through, I like how that one is going a lot better than this. Yeah. But I like the love story in it, and I think they could have used with more runtime. You know what? This isn't a Miraculous Ladybug movie. It's Ladybug and Cat Noir. No, it's not a, it's not a Ladybug and Cat Noir movie. This is, uh, this, <laughs> the reason why it's not is because they end up happy together. And that goes against the rules of the sh of Ladybug and Cat Noir. No, that's true. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> that's like the main appeal of the show. Like they, they're pining for each other constantly. I think. And it's like, it's like a testament of true love and they can never really like be together. Like they have to persevere through all of this crud. I think this was a cute love story and an alternate universe. Alternate universe. Yeah. Also, <laughs> thank God. It also could have done with at least 30 more minutes. I think um, a lot of the love story part was rushed. And they they focused mainly on the superhero story, which is like the main reason of Miraculous, which is fine, whatever. But it could have done with... 30 more minutes to introduce the love and like why Cat Noir actually loves Ladybug and like Ladybug loves Adrian because that was kind of like I feel lost like over. it was rushed. Yeah. It, the pacing was off really bad. I mean, they did a good job with like how condensed it was. Mm -hmm. Good movie. Eight out of 10. 7.5 because I rated it seven. Okay. 7.5 out of 10. Barbie got a nine. All right. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Stay beautiful. Keep playing. Bye.